Hey guys, what's going on? Matt here from todaysiphone.com. Today we're going to be taking a look at the lock screen tweak, Jelly Lock. This tweak is still in beta, but you can go inside Cydia and install it. So here it is. When I hold down this lock button that appears on my screen, I now have the option to go over and unlock my device, go to my camera, or go to Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. Now these three applications up here are all chosen by the user. I chose to put Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram there. You can put your favorite three applications right up there by going to the settings. So speaking of settings, let's unlock the device and go to the settings of Jelly Lock, and here they are. You can quickly disable the tweak. Um, and I really like this feature that it doesn't involve any resprings when you make changes. So if I want to use the white default theme, I'll show it to you guys here. I can simply adjust the themes to what I like most. So currently uh, I am rocking the iOS theme. I really like it. I think the icons look fantastic. So we'll go ahead and ooh, I'm going to an email and we're back in the settings. And so now here is the app shortcut. So I can choose three applications and I have Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So you can choose your favorite three, as I mentioned earlier, right from in this screen here. And then you can actually adjust the size and color of the circle, all that kind of stuff. So if I want to make it like a, a yellow, I can now have a yellow icon appear. Uh, you got to look really close here. Let me, let me make it a little bit darker for you. There you go. So you guys can see there, you can change the color. I prefer to leave it on um, the default white. I think it looks the best, just like that. And so now heading down more, you can swap the lock and the camera from the sides that you want it on. You can change um, how big or small the icons are, the opacity, all that kind of stuff. Now, here's another thing you can do. It can actually vibrate when you touch the unlock button or when you unlock the device. However, the iPhone's vibration doesn't feel like an Android uh, vibration when you're unlocking the device. So it's like, to me, it was awkward. Uh, and it was way too long. It was like I was getting a text by unlocking my device. Um, so I have left that off. By default, it is off. Um, hopefully in the future, maybe we could customize how long the vibration is to make it maybe a little bit more uh, workable. But at this point in time, I've left it off and I will keep it off. But I showed you guys earlier uh, the tweak Atom, which is another uh, lock screen tweak that allows you to choose your applications. And I'll tell you what, I use that one. That one is a paid tweak, um, but it still had many bugs inside of it. So I reverted back to Jelly Lock. And then last night I put Adam back on to give it another shot. We're still having some issues. I know the developers are working on it. So for right now, Jelly Lock versus um, Adam, Jelly Lock's winning currently for me. So that's my opinion. I know a few of you asked that. So there it is. Jelly Lock is winning. I really like it. Um, so that's the tweak. If you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. I'll be sure to respond to you. You guys can follow me on Twitter at TIP underscore Matt. Otherwise, you guys have an awesome day. And as always, peace.